Hi, I'm Bradley, and this is Nicholas. He's going to do a special effects. He's going to have me whatever I need. I'm going to tell you in less than 10 minutes, more than 7 games, how awesome and how lame they are, and if you should play them or not. On to the first game! It's for Wii. It is called, um, Thernalville. And the point of this game is to, like, uh, make yourself roller coasters and everything. And it's, it's really cool. So, and you do whatever you want. You put, you go, main, there's over 30 mini games. You can crash, you, when people are riding them, if they, if you don't like them, you can just crash them. And you meet new people. I call this game, I give the rating of the game, 3. On the next game. SpongeBob SquarePants is the creature of the Krusty Krab. Hell. Okay, and the point of this game is that... There's a bunch of mini games, but Plankton is taking over, so the point of the game is to kill Pl destroy Plankton and put him back to normal size. I give this rating a five. On to the next game. Sonic Sonic and the Black Knight. It is so good this game. You're like have you ever if you have ever played Link you understand this game. The point of this game is to go and fight the boss that is almost impossible to kill. And you do other things along the way. Okay? I give this rating an 8. And the next game, TMNT. Um, well, there's 9 people and everything. So, 4 people. Um, you do so many special effects. You, um, you have so many sick moves. And, have you, have you ever seen the movie? You fight Raphael. And, he kicks your ass. I give this rating a 7. And on to our last game, Sonic Colors. I can't really explain the game. You have to go through random things. You can play as your own me, or you can play as 7 different Sonic players. I give this rating a 0. Well, that's mainly it. I'm going to get new games next week. See you later.